March 2022, you said you actually compared Lil Durk and NBA Youngboy's issues to Tupac and Biggie. Yeah. That's a wild statement. Yeah. Can you elaborate why? Talking about like how they got everybody picking sides and shit. Basically, that's what I meant. Everybody picking sides and shit. They in the route, the dishes and shit. That's about it. Right. Cause, man, what are what are your thoughts on hip hop beef? You know, cause back then it was it was real, and I feel like now it's a lot more social media driven. Shit, yeah, what it is, shit, it just it's how I set up nowadays. Social media is how I set up. Right. I mean, Tupac or Biggie? <laughs> uh, I really, probably Tupac, but I ain't, I ain't grow up on any generation, so I don't really know they muted like that. But if I had to pick it, it'd be Tupac. I got you. Can you talk about your tweet to Aiden Ross saying he has nothing to worry about? <laughs> uh, um, why did I say that? <laughs> I don't know. I don't really remember having my tweets, but I, I, A and Ross cool. I rock with bro. He cool. I'm my bro. How did y'all link? Uh, I pulled up on him to his house. We did an interview. Oh, okay. You see he got banned off Twitch for saying the F word? No, I didn't really see that. That's wild. How do you feel about cancel culture and all that? I don't really too much know about it. I didn't know they just be... You know, that's why I say it's weird. Like, it's just nine days it's weird. Like, it's weird. That's like, this is an artist doing their job every day and you get them counseled. They stop making money. That's like if somebody come to your mama job, like, you don't know. And, like, you don't even know this person from campaign. But they tell your mama she fired. You know what I'm saying? And the boss, the boss agree. Everybody agree with it. Now your mama fired. She can't feed your family, feed you. You know what I'm saying? So I don't get it though.